Welcome back to episode two of the Glory Hunter, and it was a safe, safe, safe journey there on EasyJet. Landon was nice and smooth, no issues for the change. But we uh, played a few games, as you can see, and we started off well, doing all right with the form, and then we go and play. But we all know them as as Napoli. And Osherman gets them underway. We we were poor. We we were very poor, but we were able to grab a late late goal, which, as you can tell from the stats there, we we didn't we didn't deserve it at all. But when you're not playing well, this is what what you need. You need to be grinding out results. Um, especially away from home, but Osherman absolutely causing problems there. Just terrible, terrible, terrible defending. Awful, awful defending. But we did create a chance at the end. Lovely play and a lovely tap in for Milik. And that is probably the biggest game. We played so far. We suffered a one 0 defeat to Lazio, and when I say we we were we were poor, especially at home, we were disgusting, absolutely disgusting. And uh, today is the big one. We are playing AC Milan, but AC Milan aren't doing too well. They're down in the eleventh of a game in hand. So this is. Big, big opportunity to get three points on the board against one of our rivals. As we expect AC Milan to come good as the season goes on and catch up. But as you see, it's dead, dead tight here with Inter, Roma, Juventus, Napoli. And Roma and Inter have got game in hand, which one of them one of them have to play AC Milan. So, you know, we'll have to play in each other. So that will free up a defeat. Hopefully for what for one of them best scenario will be a draw. But yeah, life at Juventus has started very well. And let's go over to team selection now against AC Milan. We're gonna have Chesney in goal, Danello, Bremer, Gatti and Alexandro to back line with Lopatelli um, in the deeper role, getting us on the ball, getting us playing with Rabio in front of him and McKenny just slightly in front of Rabio. And I am commenting, uh, thinking about getting Moretti in, but it's only got 45 minutes in there, so we'll get him some point there for McKenny. Kiesa and Costa are our wingers with Vlabovic up front, who, as you can see, hasn't had a good start to the season, especially when we are sitting where we are. I think it'll be like our ninth game. He's only got two goals. Bit concerning. Bit concerning for us, because we know how much of a threat he can be, and hopefully, you know, you can turn the season around from today against AC Milan. So AC Milan are going for How's Your Nan in goal. It's the only best way of just calling them. How's, how's Your Nan? Uh, Calabri. That's for Fiat? Four? No clue. Tamori, Hernandez, Krunic, Renders, Adlai, Chiquizi, Liao, and Giroud. And there we go. Oh. If we get a draw, we go top. Put the highlights straight on. And Juventus are building the play up. Tamori. You know how much Tamori is, is the, the main danger. Liao, we've got to try and stop him. And Chesney with a good save. Good save. That's a bit of an early warning. Four minutes in. And Liao firing a warning at us. Kostic, Rabio. See time now, Rabio's got bodies in there. Alexandro, Kostic. Locatelli, keep the ball moving. Bremer. Shoot! Oh, it's a great save by Algernon. But Bremer is a threat stepping out of that here. Centre back roll. It's a, it's a. Oh my god. Well done, well done. Uh, what the fuck? 
Terrell Williams deep in the Milan half. Lava Virgil want you in the box with Kenny. With Kenny, with Ken. What a save. What's... How the hell has that stayed out? How? <laughs> I was expecting that to hit the post and go in. I'm starting to control the game now. Hopefully, no mistakes in there. Rabio. Good play to McKenny out wide to Chaser. Come on, Chaser. Line him up. Line him up, Chaser. There we go. Come on. Do that to Chaser. Come on. Swing it in. Vlad Costage coming in. Get in. Come on. Get in. For all the people coming in back post, I wouldn't <laughs> think that Costage would be an aerial threat. Well, he's just showed it there that he actually is aerial threat. And what a leap. Look at that. Oh, that is lovely to see. It's something about headed goals. Headed goals. Come on. Come on, the boys. Can we get? Can we make it two just before half time? Costa swings it in. Lavovic! Come on! Come on! Oh, maybe this is it for Flavovic. Well, ball gets up between two. Oh, and how is your nan had no chance? Hopefully, this is not a little early celebration cup of tea, but it's half time. And a well deserved brew and a nice chilly night. Oh, we're into the 70th minute mark for the second half, and nothing is really changed. So, we're going to make a few changes. We're going to bring on the new signing, Magno. Big, big future. Kenny is going to come off for Moretti. I like I like the way Moretti is as well. You know, he had a very good start to the season, filling in for the Rabio role. But I think he's going to be better than McKenny going forward. Uh, Locatelli is on the yellow, but he's you know, hopefully he's not doesn't do anything daft here. I think we should be okay for subs in the meantime. Come on, let me say that. And there we go. The highlights on Kiesa skipping past. Can he get down that wing again? He's having a great game, Casey. Knocks it in. No one here but Kenny. Costage. Oh, lucky lads. So lucky. Nice play. Keep that pressure on. Don't come set back. Don't fall back into the defence. Just keep going at them. Because they've got to come at us. And as they come out, the gaps will appear. The gaps will appear. And let's just make a few uh, changes. Bring a few people on. Uh, bring Miller on. <laughs> Blavich had a good game. Take hostage off for Ealing. Just freshen up that attacking line as the defence the tyrant. And AC Milan. How your nan goes long to Giroud's head. We battle. The ball's not settled. Renders. I'm just going to call them Renders because I don't know. probably getting it wrong. But, you know, I'm expecting... FM to FM things and AC Milan to get a goal here, but no, Illing steps in, wins the ball, it's Magno, Magno, we need to slide it through, oh, he keeps going, Magno, bad boy, he keeps going, Magno, Rabio! and it's over, it is over, we absolutely batter AC Milan, Magno gets a bit lucky here with, the, with Hernandez with the... Um, Block falling straight back to him. and there's the skipper, right foot, knocking the ball into the empty net to make it free, and the game is done and dusted. And there we have it, Juventus, we put the sword to AC Milan, AC Milan do not have the answers, and we dominate them in every aspect, every single aspect, and life at Juventus at the moment is going very, very well. And there's the league table. We sit top of the table. Inter and Roma do have two games in hand on us. But I'm thinking they might be having to play each other at some point in this with having two games. So Sutton's got to give there, hopefully, a draw. Draw would be ideal for us. But we're starting to build a bit of a gap from Lazio. Early doors, early doors, but look where AC Milan are. AC Milan are down in the 11th position. Uh, schedule. So, don't have any big, big games coming up, are we there? Not very big. So, we'll probably come back. Oh, probably around the Udinese or the Lanta game. 
So, yeah. If you are enjoying the Glory Hunter, make sure you like, subscribe, and turn your notification bell on. And thank you to everyone who has watched episode one. I wouldn't expect, well, I wouldn't expect anyone to, to watch it. And I've seen there was 77 views. So thank you for every single one of you for watching it. And I hope uh, we keep growing and you keep enjoying the Glory Hunter. And hopefully we can get Italy done and dusted in season one. Peace.